Hey, what is up everyone? I hope all of you are doing great and in today's question we have a particle of mass m is connected with fixed vertical cylinder with the help of a string of length l naught equals 2 pi r. So this string is of length 2 pi r. As shown in the figure, the particle is given a horizontal velocity v naught perpendicular to the string and it moves on a smooth horizontal surface. Then choose the correct options. Okay, uh, Take some time, try this question on your own and let me know in the comments which options are you getting okay uh, this questions looks like they have copied from erodov uh, so let's get to the solution quickly so after some time some amount of the string will cover or will align with the surface of the cylinder the cylinder is fixed okay so this length is r theta so the length of the string that is rotating okay that is not connected with the cylinder right now would be l minus r theta now and there is no friction there is no effect of gravity this whole thing is the top view of the motion uh, it is on a horizontal plane right so only tension is acting and this tension is perpendicular to the motion of the particle so of course this tension won't hamper the speed because it will not do any work okay so the speed will remain constant right so if the speed remains constant option b is correct right now with increase in time the length of the string that is not connected with the cylinder i mean that is not attached with the cylinder decreases but speed remains the same okay now this person is performing a circular motion with respect to this point right so we can write t equals mv naught square divided by instantaneous the radius okay so with time theta is increasing so this denominator is decreasing and tension is increasing okay so tension is increasing continuously option c is also correct now time after which the particle will collide with the cylinder so a time will come when this particle will take a spiral path and it will hit the cylinder that means the whole string has wrapped over the cylindrical surface right so at any instant the angular velocity of this particle with respect to this point is v naught divided by this length right so the angular velocity is v naught divided by l minus r that is nothing but rate of change of theta because a small wrapping over here would be a small change in angular displacement of d theta right okay so you can write d theta dt now just integrating theta from 0 to l by r because when the whole string wraps the cylinder of radius r it will be l by r it taking a time t so after integrating you get t equals l square by 2 r v naught l is given in the question it is equal to 2 pi r so the time taken is 2 pi square r by v naught so option d is also correct okay speed of the particle remains constant so option a would be incorrect right so final op answers are b c and d so i hope you all have found this video helpful and informative and i'll see you in the next one peace